Welcome back to another episode of Bioshock Infinite. As you can see, I've got a bit of a different gun because I had to replay this section again just because for some reason it didn't really save. So yeah, let's get into this. Continue the game. I did also find like some lock pits and some other bits and stuff, but I'll just take a little bit longer. I mean, in the playthroughs, I like to just kind of keep it going. I feel like it might be a little bit boring to watch. Was like free stuff. Oh, shotgun ammo, that's something we actually need. <laughs> so low on it. I feel like some like pre loads would be really good. And. Oh, uh, it's like. It's exactly the same as the other area. Oh my god, big fights are going to go down if there's no good people around. There's a reason for that. Oh, More continue. money. Ooh. Catch, Mr. DeWitt. Thank you, Elizabeth. What? Oh. Let's do this. Okay, we got people again. We're going the wrong way. I'm such a moron. I'm a bit of a moron. We're meant to go over here. That's some shotgun or sh uh, machine gun I dropped earlier. Cool. Okay, this makes sense. I'm just being stupid. Do this. Booker. It's Slate's locker. He must have worked here. This is my mother's diary. Why would Slate have it? My husband claims the child was created from whole cloth by divine will. I am a believer, but I am not a fool. His bastard shall not be raised under this roof. My mother. She had me locked in that tower. Elizabeth. I just want to get out of this city. Please. Nice. share with you my personal creed. What is the most admirable creature on God's green earth? Why, it's the bee. Have you ever seen a bee on vacation? Have you ever seen a bee take a sick day? Well, my friends, the answer is no. So I say, be the bee. Be the bee. Uh, uh, hello? Mr. DeWitt? Uh, yes? Alter, Mr. Fink, please. What's going on? DeWitt, Fink here. Listen, my boy, we've had our eye on you, and I can tell you right now that you are our top candidate. Top! <laughs> now, uh, my associate, Mr. Flambeau, will help you with anything you need. <laughs> what the hell was that? I have no idea. He seems... Oddly pleased to make your acquaintance. Whoa. Well, the man's got an ego. I love how everything like steam powered. What well, kind of is? There's that like crazy blue energy thing as well, isn't there? Now, some say to me, think, why is it that we can pay the tokens that are only good at the company store? Well, I'll tell you what, I'll be damned if I let any of you poor folk get robbed at some shady establishment. You see, the Fink Company store brings you Fink products at a price designed specifically for the Fink Worker. Please, please. Mr. DeWitt, welcome to Finkton. You'll find a variety of supplies here that should see you through your visit. Hand cannon. 
This is just what revolver. What does Mr. Fink want with us? Excuse me, miss, but Mr. Fink's interest is strictly in the gentleman. But why... So sorry, young miss. But any questions regarding the gentleman's application should be taken up with Mr. Fink directly. Does this strike you as good news? Does this strike me as good news? I tell you, that is flipping slave labor in this place. What do you think? Head to the gunsmith or scavenge supplies by that clock shop? Clock shop, that's a clock shop. Ooh, this looks like a clock shop. Not really, but okay, it's got stuff. Sniper rifle. I just don't think it's like a really great gun in this game. Like, it's very powerful. Any increases on guns we actually use? No. Ooh, okay. You know about this. Here it is, Booker. Like... Oh, yeah. Sick. I wonder if you did shoot one of the cops, if, if it actually allows you in the first place. See if you do, they're gonna start to try to kill you. Pistol. Such a crazy one. Let's do it. Catch, Mr. DeWitt. That'll do. Oh, I don't have a good feeling about this at all. I'm just full on shotgun ammo, which makes me very happy. Down we go, question mark. Ooh, that's probably very cozy. What's over here? This toolbox and leaves it empty. I've read about this. That's got my Buddha. Who? The founder of Buddhism. Spent 49 days under a Bodhi tree until he achieved enlightenment. Something that tells me Comstock doesn't cater to idols getting worshipped that ain't him. Hello? <laughs> Hello? Mr. Lin? Chen Lin? Is anybody here? Someone worked this place over. Uh. Local constabulary, no doubt. Do you hear that? There's someone downstairs. Excuse me. Man, I'm sorry to bother you. I... You're looking for Mr. Lin? Mr. Chen Lin? Booker. Mr. Lin, not here. He... gone. Gone? They take... flying squad. I pray, Gautama Buddha. Pray, give husband back. Give back to Mei Lin. Where did they take him? Club. Everyone take to good time club. Where is this club? Ma'am, please, where, where is this club? Booker, we'll find it. Just leave her be. Why not Vox Bully help Chen Lin? Why not Daisy Fitzroy help Chen Lin? Good flying squad. Cops. The kind who probably got their boot on Lin's throat asking him how well he knows Daisy Fitzroy. Isn't she the one we're working for? As a matter of fact, it is. Right, let's figure out where this good time club is. Do not have a good feeling about this. Oh. What was that rumble for? Look out! Handyman! Down low, huh? Oh, no. Hi, mother trucker. It's not actually anything useful, that. Right? Okay, we need to ditch this gun ASAP. We need to take out that turret. Oh, 
dollars will know. I was born I'm sorry dead. about what I said at the docks. I hear what it is people are saying. Yeah. Uh, Let's see how I might have changed your sense of that. We have to work 16 hours a day. No. Let's Got that pistol from in there. I would like I think that's the best option right now. shorten your work day. But the fact is, I simply can't. Oh wait, hold on. There's, the, there's a rifle over here that I was like knocking. Ooh, what's this? New boots, tunnel vision, aiming increase. Hip firing reduced. How's that going to be useful? Reduce the other unless it reduces the other. The bad guy's damage. I guess that must be it. How is that? I hear it. It's everything up from that. Oh shoot! Remember to use your vote. Yeah, I know. Okay. Don't worry, I'll remember to use it this time. I oh, know we're not meant to go this way, but I'm in trouble. I just don't think we need any of that. What's that? It's coming from that tear. I never heard that song before. <laughs> Someone keeps keeps an RPG ammo in a cigar tin. That's amazing. Right, let's progress, guys. Let's not get too... In there, I guess, yeah. There it is, Mr. DeWitt. Now we just need to head inside and find Mr. Lin. And just call me Booker. Let's do it. Let's just get some bits and bobs before we. That uh, really has a chance. Applicant doesn't know he's being evaluated. <laughs> but I've watched you since the other day at the lottery. <laughs> You're a brute. Open it. Times like this, I could use a brute. What do you want, Fink? My labor unrest is coming to it. <laughs> now, Fitzroy has got Damn, to that one. all riled up. A man like me could have use of an old Pinkerton like you. Oh my. Let's find Shen Lin and get the hell out of here. Now, now, all I ask is that you finish what you started to it. Uh -oh. Wouldn't want to disappoint the other applicants. Our first candidate is a veteran of Peking. Now, what's that they say about old soldiers? <laughs> Frankly, my money's on you. Here's so something of an old hand at handling explosives. Only man I know who hasn't <laughs> lost a limb working with them. <laughs> Yet. Quite 
what to do with themselves. Pick this one up at a hiring fair for a song. Some mad recoil and stuff. Oh, hand cannon. Hell oh, yeah. Let's see what this thing does. Interested in your job, Fink. Now, yeah, now Fink. I know all about your little job for Fitzroy. But do you really want to take her offer over mine? Do you know how many people would kill to be head of Fink Security? <laughs> You're a tough nut to crack, Mr. DeWitt. A tough nut. <laughs> but I promise you this. Need money? I will get what I want. Oh wait, what? Oh, there's another bad guy. Look, there's a door over here. I think that's the way down. Cool. Nice. Oh, hold on, salts over there. Let's get salts. As we're actually starting to use them. Let's use. I like the electricity. Let's use a bit of that. What's it called? The horse thing. Yeah, let's use the horse thing. This looks crazy. Let's do some damage, man. Employees only. Oh. Three stuff. We're going to free stuff. You're a modern woman. It's 1912. It's going to be 2012 before I'm interested in one like you. <laughs> 2012. Come on! The invasion! Anything in here? Of course. Ammo. Ooh, not fit. I don't know if they get used, or if the more we have the kind of higher level Found stuff we can money. Want it? Of course. Elizabeth. Looks easy enough. I used to work for folks like Fink. Really? I was with the Pinkertons. They call us in when the workers got restless. To do what? Demonstrate the folly of men striking, throwing down tools. You hurt people. I'll tell you this. Sometimes there's precious need for folks like Fitzroy. Why? Because of folks like me. There you go. Thank you. Disposal. Who's there? Jeez, man. Ooh. Ooh. Hey, 
bit sinister. Oh, it's a code book for a cipher. A secret message from the Vox Populi. Secret codes? The cipher should be around somewhere. Tell us what you know about Fitzroy, you goddamn gook. We know you can hear us. You wanna say something? Or you want us to bring in Mrs. Lynn for company? Uh, throw a bucket of ice water on him. We got three more to bring in tonight. Gee. Oh, dude. No privies down here. Let's see what this does. So that is, yeah, we need to use this more. That is amazing. What could people have done to deserve to be locked up in a place like this? Think don't need much of a reason. No. Class five picks. Got a lock needs picking. picking. No problem. This is it, isn't it? Okay. Number nine. Got it. Do it? You're a lion. But you can't blame me for looking after my own interests, can you? Now I know Fitzroy has come calling, but I think you'll find your business with her. Come to an end. <laughs> lions walk with lions, to it, not hyenas. Well, what if I want to? I can't see anything. No. Now we need to find someone else to make those guns. No. Dead is dead, Elizabeth. Dead is dead. What? How the hell did... I see heads. And I see tails. It's all a matter of perspective. Why are you following us? Who sent you? Comstock? What do you want? What do you see here, from this angle? Dead. Listen. And that angle? Alive. Walker. Chen Lin. It was never here. It's another Columbia. A different Columbia. The same coin. A different perspective. Heads. Tails. Dead. Alive. We have to go through. To this other Columbia. But how? It's like riding a bicycle. You never really forget. One just needs the courage to climb aboard. Huh. Very If strange. we go into this tear. Back. Are you sure you're ready? Open the tab. Oh. Alright, well, we'll leave it here for this episode. See you in the next one where we're going to be going to a different dimension in a bit.